Okay, guys. Uh, I think we missed yesterday. Did we miss yesterday? We missed yesterday. So today is a new day, and it's actually day whatever day it is. Um, <laughs> as you can tell, we're getting, all getting a bit silly. Uh, we've just we've just uh, come from. So right now we are well still at the Dolphin, where we're staying. Um, and we've just been across the road-ish, kind of up, uh, up that way, behind the trees, uh, for a massage. I actually got a 15 minute head massage, and I got a one hour deep tissue slash, um, what was it? Hippocratic massage. It was kind of like this hybrid one, because yeah, I mean, my back was, and a lot of pain, kind of needed like a bit of seeing too. But um, yeah, it was really good. Uh, the my, my massage that I had was 55 euros. Um, I think I do have like a, a video of, of the prices and explanations of what the massages are, what type of massages they are. So mine was 55 uh, for an hour, and Ashes was 15 for 15 minutes. So that's pretty good. Yeah, she had the head massage. I've yeah. have said that already. That's okay. Uh, so now we are down um, at our beach, which is called? Palatica. Palatica Beach, we believe. And you know, it's kind of, it's the one that flows off the dolphin. Um, and yeah, after, you know, a nice relaxing kind of massage with oils and stuff. We're now gonna get in the water and just chill. Today I think is another chill day. I had a orange and almond oil in you. Oh yeah, so I had, yeah, you get to choose like what flavor or what aroma your um, oils are. Asha had the orange and I had, what? And almond. Orange and almond. And I had coffee and vanilla, I believe. Yeah, so really nice. Um, it was sort of set up by uh, the Odyssey Hotel, which is just across the road, like I said. Um, it's a, like a freelance person that kind of comes in. You go in, well, how we organized it, we went in. Obviously, we're not staying at the Odyssey, we're staying at the Dolphin. Um, so yeah, we went in and just asked and you kind of have to book a day before and then she comes down whenever you are ready to get some massaging. And now we are ooh, doing some more water stuff. And chilling. Because the weather has broken. It is now sunny, 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 sunny. And yeah, it's kind of scheduled or scheduled? forecast to be sunny for the next forever that we're here. Um, I think in some other ones I did say that we've extended our, our um, stay here in Corfu and also here at the Dolphin. Um, but then, so I think we're staying here tonight. This is one extra. No, last night was one extra and tonight is one extra. Then tomorrow we go to a different one. Um, and yeah, we're quite lucky that kind of those gray clouds have kind of dissipated into blue sky and white clouds. But also, you know, it's quite interesting. You compare a cloudy day on Corfu to a cloudy day in London, you get very different uh, situations. Um, I'm sure there are real cloudy days here, but you know, nothing like the blanket that we um, are subject to in old blighty anyway uh blah 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 i am going to get in the water it's looking very clear today as well pretty nice i've got my googles uh gonna do some googling uh i don't know i'm gonna take you with me for a little bit but i think you've probably had enough of all the um all the um all the um underwater shots perhaps Oh look, there's a mermaid. Okay, catch you in a bit.
was the little swim, afternoon swim, after our massage. Um, heading up to our room for some self-catered Greek salad salami stuff. Um, yes. I uh, don't know what else is coming. I think we're doing stuff later, something. So yeah, I'll check back in with you then. May show a bit of uh, the food, maybe? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Go. I think this is dolphin. Dolphini, maybe, even. In Greek lettering. And there's the arbor. Is the mermaid. Bye. Hello. <laughs> um, so. Kalimera. 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 So as we've kind of decided to inadvertently stay a little bit longer, we thought maybe we would save a bit of cash and do some more like self-catering things. As you can see there, I should hear something the nice food from the corner shop um, yeah they have like little mini supermarkets I guess they call them supermarkets but yeah they're kind of mini marts um, and yeah we've just kind of yeah looked at what the Greek salads and things have in, have in them are involved with them and we just kind of copied it a little bit so in here we've got like all sorts Actually, there is some Greek salami, which is really nice. Um, ah, yes, made in Corfu, actually. <coughs> um, a croissant, uh, some feta cheese from Corfu as well, probably. Yeah, from Corfu. Corfu feta cheese, um, Corfu olives. Are they Corfu as well? Yeah. Corfu olives. Corfu. Everything's Corfu. Um, and some other salad stuff, some avocado and. Uh, what? Cucumber and peppers, okay. tomatoes, probably all morally and um, locally sourced, locally grown. So, yeah, thought we'd save some money. And olive oil as well, you bought from Corfu. And olive oil is also Corfu, yes. And yeah, so we're just outside our guest house thing. It's actually, well, part of the guest house. We do have kind of this patio area and still a little selection or section of sun. They were trying to catch before it hid behind that hid land. Yes. Uh, and we still yeah, get to make the best of an amazing view. Ta da! Ta da! -ta. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like, I mean, price wise, there's all a bit of a mixed bag, really. So, yeah, I mean, we kind of worked out that it's maybe about half the price of eating out. Kind of depending on. Morning. It was um, 35 euro. 35 but, euro, but we're um, making like probably th three lunches for and two. For breakfast. For two people. So, yeah. So that's, definitely half price. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'd say yeah, half price. But we are planning on eating at the Dolphin because yeah, there is um, probably for for dinner tonight. The nicest place, nice nice uh, service. Very friendly people. Really friendly, it just yeah. It feels like at home and you don't want to go away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so nice. And yeah, you know, there is something to be said for, I guess, self catering. Um, you know, it's cheaper. But, you know, to get the authentic Greek taste, Greek seasoning, yeah. Greek flavors, you know, obviously getting some, uh, uh, the Greek kitchen to make it for you is. Obviously, more what, genuine, more authentic. Authentic is the word. Yes. Um, but yes, um, the 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 room itself kind of lends itself slightly to self catering. Like it's got like a fridge um, and a kettle, um, but it doesn't have anything like cookie cooking wise hot plate thing. So that's. But if you get vegetables and. Um, 
Greek yogurt and lunch of made of salads so you can do that in the dinner you can just go and eat out like we do and then <clears throat> basically you kind of pay for food a day this way maybe around <clears throat> 15 to 20 euro. So. Yeah, so I think in total? Yeah, probably. Something like that. Um, yeah, so maybe you know a way to save some money, but and then also you know at the end of each day still get some authentic authentic Greek food. Anyway guys, I've been talking enough and I'm hungry, so I'll see you later. Ashes will already finish his. Hello, hello. Now we ate, went on a little nap, had a nice chat. This is the grape tree we have here in the Dolphin Hotel. And now we're going upstairs to our room, get ready before going to another adventure to the beach land so i don't know if you met already our cactus 